Parker is out of the game. Eddie Perez restrains Andrew Jones. And now we got a little pushing and shoving going on. And here come the bullpens again. Randall Simon was quick out of the dugout for his countryman who had the ball thrown behind him. Simon was the one out there quickly. Kent Merker vehemently upset yelling at Larry Poncino for throwing him out. The last thing Merker wants to do is leave this game with a 6 0 lead. But that's what's going to happen. Well, it's a little more than it was the first time around. Poncino made a trip to the mound before the inning started to talk to Kent Merker, then pulled out his lineup card as if he was making a note as to when he made the warning to Kent Merker. If he did, in fact, warn him, then Kent got what he asked for. But the crowd out on the diamond is still still hasn't separated much. I think that pitch went behind Andrew Jones. That's yeah, it what did. upset him. It did, and Langford being pushed back by yeah. I think Mark DeJohn, one of the coaches. But I don't know how Randall Simon got out there so quick unless he was on the steps of the dugout ready. It may have hit Andrew. I'm not sure, Skip, but it definitely was behind him. It was a glancing blow. That's if it did hit him, that's for sure. Take another look. I think it missed him altogether. So Merker is ejected here. I'll tell you what, it, I can't fault Poncino for that. You throw behind a guy after the situation that occurred, you almost have to. Again, obvious. Too obvious. But knowing Merker as I do, as vociferous as his argument was, I don't know what his point was. Unless he's saying that he didn't get a warning, now don't get into that, Kent. You no, know, cost don't. yourself a lot of money. No, don't need that. And if there, we've got 25 security people standing on the field and nobody that's keeping that fan's head out of the dugout, that's amazing. Well, they're going to have to get another pitcher, and that pitcher is going to be given the time he needs to warm up. Well, everybody's getting in shape tonight, especially the guys in the bullpen. They're getting their running in. Yes, they are. And Larissa is still arguing. Kent Merker, I'm sure, will earn some points from his teammates for protecting Ray Langford as he just did. But again, it was far too obvious for him to be allowed to stay in the ball game. That might be what he's arguing about is that he never did get a warning. Could be. I mean I'm just guessing but I mm -hmm. can't I can't understand how else or why else he would be arguing. Indian 